Another St. Patrick's Day tradition has Siouxlanders getting rid of their hair, all in the name of childhood cancer research. It's what the annual St. Baldrick's Foundation head shaving event is all about. KCAU 9 reporter Lydia Vasquez was there and got a first hand look at things. She joins us now with more on this special event. Lydia? Tim, donors and volunteers joined in on the head shaving fun at Leeds Barbershop today. You didn't have to get your head shaved, but those who did say it's about more than the money. Leeds Barbershop has been raising funds and awareness for childhood cancer research for the past 12 years. This is my third year doing this, and I, this is the best thing I ever did in my life. Robert Davis's motto is, don't be scared, rock the bald. Dwayne Harvey owns Leeds Barbershop. He says his clippers are ready to match last year's goal. Our goal this year is $40,000. Um, when we raise $40,000 today, um, we will have donated $200,000 to the foundation. The money raised will be donated to hospitals and foundations supporting childhood cancer research in Siouxland, Omaha, and Sioux Falls. Harvey says the event is a fun way to bring the community together for a good cause. But he says it's also an event close to his heart. It means a lot to me. Uh, uh, had a lot of people in my life that, that uh, had dealt with uh, cancer. And, and uh, so it's a, it's a great honor to be a part of uh, this group. This is the second year Corey Wallace has shaved his head. The event has a special meaning for him, too. I have a rare uh, blood disorder that's precancerous that they really don't know what to do about. I've gone through it myself and still going through it. I think it's an important cause. It doesn't take much to help out, you know, to be a part of the community and do something positive. So the goal was to raise $40,000 and shave 50 heads. We just checked before showtime and they have raised nearly $38,000 and shaved up to 27 heads. So the event wraps up in about an hour, but you can donate to the St. Baldrick's Foundation at any time. Reporting live in the newsroom, Lydia Vasquez, KCAU 9 News.